a hole. This is a member of the voice of reason I'm coming out to you. And I just found out that apparently dumpster diving is very illegal. Um, I did some checking around and it turns out no matter where you go in America, it is very illegal. If you get caught doing it, you're going to get arrested. You're going to go to jail. Um, but it's also, you know, very dumb to sit there to videotape yourself dumpster diving and then putting it all over YouTube. Now, let's not kid ourselves. Dumpster diving will never be allowed. Here's why. You get a, you get a shirt or a pair of sneakers, you know, you get a defective item from a department store and you break a foot because the sole came loose or you get a rash from wearing the shirt um, or you let's say you got to grab something like a kayak and the kayak is defective and you get hurt while using it. They're liable to be sued. And also because it's still a store product, even though it's in their dumpster, it's on their property. You're technically, you have stolen property. Now, dumpster diving is not allowed. It's, it's very illegal. If you get caught doing it, you're going to get arrested. Now, I'll say this, I'll say this evidently clear. To Mike the Scavenger and every other YouTuber that's dumb enough to film yourself dumpster diving. You're morons. Um, you're promoting the idea that easy money is good money, uh, easy money is legal. And eventually when a federal prosecutor gets your stupid asses on camera and um, gets a hold of your YouTube channels and uses it to have you locked up in prison, it's going to be your own damn fault. Here's the thing. If you have a YouTube channel and you are known for doing that, one thing you don't want to do is you don't want to sit there and get caught doing that stuff because if you have a wife, you have children, you have a family, you have bills and expenses, you have a life you have to maintain, guess what? In the long run, you're going to end up, you're going to end up paying the, the ultimate price for it. You can kid yourself all you want, but bottom line is, the fact of the matter is, you're breaking the law. And you're taking a really risky gamble, gamble, gamble doing it. Now, I don't mean to sound like a jerk, but, you know, let's, let's not kid ourselves. You're making easy, you're trying to make easy money, you're promoting, you're, you're putting yourselves out there, and there's a lot of other people who are amateur scrappers or who think that dumpster diving is okay when it's not. You're putting the message out there that this, this, uh, this act activity is legal when it's not. And some of you YouTubers do have wives. Some of you do have children, have kids. Some of you do have families to support. You guys are morons, you're jackasses. And when eventually your stupid asses end up put in prison and, you're, and YouTube has to, has, to, has to close out your accounts, it, it will be your own damn fault. Just so that no matter, just to enter the, enter, enter the general public, no matter what they tell you, easy money is usually illegal money. If it's easy money and you don't, if you don't, um, if you don't have to sweat and, um, and suffer to get your money, it's probably illegal. If you don't have to kowtow to a boss, it's illegal money. Scrapping? Technically, you're not paying any taxes on it. So, yeah, you know, there's a lot of different people that have an issue with that. Anyway, just remember, don't dumpster dive.